Hello, everyone, and welcome to today's meditation. Please sit comfortably and close your eyes, allowing your body to settle in to wherever you're sitting. The magic of today's meditation begins with breath. So let's take a few relaxing, refreshing breaths. Breathing deep into your belly, feeling your stomach expand. Inhale for four seconds. Hold, and exhale for four seconds. Let's do that again. If you like, as you inhale, perhaps go just a little bit deeper. Inhale for four seconds. Hold. And exhale for four seconds. And once more. Inhale for four seconds. Hold, and exhale for four seconds. And now just breathe effortlessly without forcing your breath. Simply observing your breath as it naturally flows in and naturally flows out. Today, let's focus on overcoming anger. Of course, we all feel anger from time to time, both in our personal lives and as we bear witness to injustice, hatred, and violence around the world. Anger is natural and if properly directed, can often lead to positive emotions and actions, such as resolve and determination and commitment for positive change. But anger by itself can be completely destructive and toxic. In the words of Benjamin Franklin, Actions begun in anger often end in shame. And the Buddha once said, holding on to anger is like grasping a hot coal with the intention of throwing it at someone. You are the one who gets burned. And in the Talmud it is written, Anger can cause a sage to lose his wisdom and a person destined for greatness to forfeit it. So today, let's expand our ability to let go of anger. Begin if you like by bringing to your awareness a recent experience where you felt angry. It can be a personal situation, something at work, 
something from world events. It can be something small or something large. And now imagine the events that caused you anger or rage. Imagine those events are a scene in a movie. Imagine you're sitting alone in a theater watching these events on a movie screen in front of you. And as you see these events on the screen, observe all of the emotions attached to the moment. Anger and frustration, perhaps sadness. Perhaps heartache. Perhaps a feeling of powerlessness. Simply, gently observe from a seat in a movie theater. And now imagine that the scene on the movie screen is getting smaller. Become aware of the picture on the screen getting smaller and smaller and smaller until you can barely see the scene playing at all. And as that scene gets smaller and smaller, feel the impact on your heart grow dimmer and dimmer and dimmer until you can barely see the event and barely feel the pain and anger at all. And now become aware that the genesis of anger is pain and the starting point of pain is the desire for something beautiful and hopeful. Anger at its core rests on pain, and pain comes from love and hope. So become aware of the positive energy of love that underlies your hopes and dreams. See that love and hopefulness as a tiny light shining on the movie screen in front of you. And now become aware of this positive, bright light of love and hope growing larger and larger, getting brighter and stronger until it feel, fills the entire screen. This is the light of your devotion, your passion, your hope, it is the intrinsic, eternal light of love that resides within you. So allow this light to grow even more, expanding beyond the screen to fill the entire room. Feel your devotion growing. Feel your hope expanding. Embrace this light and allow 
its positive energy to flow throughout your entire body. This is the light within you. Remind yourself to never be defined by your disappointments or anger. But rather to embrace the hope and love of your true self. you like, repeat the following intention silently once or twice. I release anger. I embrace hope. And now bring your awareness back to your breath, resting quietly for a moment, resting in awareness. Resting in gratitude for this moment. Resting in existence. And as you go about your day, remember that while we all experience anger from time to time, We all have the ability to manage and redirect our anger. In the words of Thich Nhat Hanh, anger is like a storm rising up from the bottom of our consciousness. When we feel it coming, we must learn to turn our focus to our breath. And so have the intention to emerge towards greater control of our anger greater commitment to the hope and love that lies within us greater clarity and greater wisdom And now, if you like, feel free to unmute your line and bring your palms together in front of your heart center. And let's chant together the Sanskrit word for being, Om. Namaste. 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 Thank you, Brian. Um, Thank you, Brian. Namaste. Namaste. Thank you, Brian. Thank you, Brian. Wonderful day.